Arrows flew, clay targets were busted, and tests were taken, all part of the 4-H North Louisiana Region Outdoor Skills Competition. The event, held at the Long Range Gun Club near Frierson, shows how popular outdoor skills have become with 4-H students in a state known for its outdoor adventures. We're probably at about five to 6,000 kids that are involved in it as far as competition, which are coming to the two regionals that we have. We're close to 2,000. According to Bolt, an event of this magnitude could not occur without volunteer support. Many of the volunteers took several days of vacation to support a program they believe brings communities together. We give such an investment in the other children in our school and our parish that we want to see them do well and support them, so we take our vacation day to come and be out with them. While many competitors were setting their sights on becoming eligible for the state competition, there was a greater emphasis on gun safety. Safety is our number one priority. We want the kids to have fun, but we want to be safe. We teach them gun safety skills of using the shotgun properly, and it's something that they can take with them um, out into the hunting woods for the rest of their life. Some of the students competed in an outdoor skills competition that included a wildlife ID test, shooting a bow, rifle, and shotgun, and an orienteering component. Stone Adair of Sabine Parish prefers shooting a bow. It takes a lot more practice, and like when you see you hit it, it makes you feel you've done something. While there was a competitive element, it didn't stop the competitors from having a good time. You get to come spend the day with everybody who loves doing the same thing as you, and you get to have fun with your friends, and it's, it's pretty laid back. With the LSU Ag Center, this is Craig Gotro reporting.